हेलो फ्रेंड्स डिस्कस करेंगे लुसेन की इंडियन पॉलिटी एंड कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन तो स्टार्ट करेंगे पॉलिटी से पॉलिटी तो हम रिपब्लिक ऑफ इंडिया से स्टार्ट करेंगे तो इंडिया अ यूनियन ऑफ स्टेट्स इज अ सोवरेन सोशलिस्ट सेकुलर डेमोक्रेटिक रिपब्लिक विद द पार्लियामेंटरी सिस्टम ऑफ गवर्नमेंट the republic is governed in terms of the constitution which has which was adopted by constitution assembly on november 26 1949 and came into force on january 26 1950 the constitution which envisage parliamentary form of government is federal in structure with unitary features the president of india is the constitutional head of executive of the union Article seventy four. One. Article seventy four, clause one. Of the constitution provides that there shall be a council of ministers. Article seventy four. There shall be a council of minister with the prime minister as its head to aid and advise the president, who shall in exercise of his function. act in accordance with such advice the real executive power thus vest in the council of ministers with the prime minister as its head the council of ministers is collectively responsible to the house of the people that is lok sabha similarly in the states the governor is the head of the executive but it is the council of ministers with the chief minister as its head in whom real executive power vests the council of ministers of a state is collectively responsible to the legislative assembly of the state the constitution the constitution distributes legislative power between parliament and state legislatures and provides for vesting of resi residual powers in parliament the power to amend the constitution also vests in parliament the constitution has a provision for independence of judiciary comptroller and auditor general public service commission and chief election commission 